NBC5 News at 6 starts now. A slow speed chase in a stolen RV lands a man in the Jackson County Jail. Good evening and thank you for choosing NBC 5 News at 6. I'm Craig Spoller. And I'm Kristen Hosfeld. The chase ended in downtown Medford, but police say it started several miles away. NBC 5's Natalie Weber is live from the scene with the rest of the story in tonight's top story at 6. Natalie? Craig, Kristen, this parking garage is where the chase ultimately ended. The RV was just too tall to make it all the way through. Tonight, the suspect is in custody and police are continuing to investigate. Woke up to uh, the police going around the block and lots of sirens and lots of noise. It wasn't the wake up call Rick Mowry was expecting. Came out to check it out and uh, so this RV parked here. Police say that RV led officers on a chase into downtown Medford. They first spotted it on Highway 99 and Valley View Road early Wednesday morning. This motorhome, along with the tow vehicle that was behind it, was obstructing traffic. According to Medford Police uh, Lieutenant area, Justin Ivins, Oregon State Police tried to wake up the people inside but couldn't. Instead, they marked the RV to be towed. Later on, he, uh, the trooper uh, comes back, observes uh, some additional violations with the vehicle and how it's parked, so he tries to reach out to the registered owner of the vehicle uh, via phone. After talking with police, the owner went to check his RV, which, as it turns out, wasn't there. It had been stolen. But by then, police say the RV was on the move. The officers attempted to block the vehicle in and uh, the driver uh, proceeded to take off, ramming uh, the front of the OSP patrol car. Police say the slow moving pursuit spanned downtown Medford. Officers even tried using spike strips to stop the RV, but it was a low ceiling parking garage that finally did the trick. Ultimately came into this back alley and really nowhere to go at this point and was kind of blocked in here and we were able to take the uh, suspect into custody. That suspect, Aubrey General, is facing numerous charges tonight, including reckless driving and recklessly endangering another person. Police say there was a child inside the RV at the time. Once it was pulled over, they were able to get that child to safety. No injuries were reported in this incident. Live in Medford, Natalie Weber, NBC5 News.